500 meters above Victoria, Australia. The vast land is spread out below, where plants grow and finish their first roll. They are then buried underground, awaiting the day we meet again. Brown coal is young coal, widely distributed all over the world. It is used to generate electricity here in Victoria. However, brown coal has a high moisture content of 60% and tends to combust spontaneously when dried. Therefore, it is unsuitable for transport and is limited to local use. Victoria has enough brown coal to meet 240 years of total power demand in Japan. Could it be used? By taking advantage of Kawasaki technology and by applying Kawasaki's gas refining technology, could this underutilized resource be used to produce hydrogen in large quantities at a reasonable cost? By applying Kawasaki's cryogenic technology, could large quantities of hydrogen be transported to Japan? Kawasaki is already taking action toward these goals. In December 2013, Kawasaki secured approval in principle for a liquefied hydrogen carrier cargo containment system. Then began work on building a small-scale liquefied hydrogen carrier. And in November 2014, Kawasaki announced completion of Japan's first industrial hydrogen liquefaction system made completely in Japan using proprietary Kawasaki technology. Performance tests of liquefied hydrogen production are now underway. To promote the widespread use of hydrogen energy. And to contribute to a more prosperous life for people around the world. And to the future of the global environment. Kawasaki is taking the initiative by combining its comprehensive technological capabilities. Kawasaki, Hydrogen Road.